It's Joshy Blogs here. Um, <coughs> so I'm I'm feeling this um, run a bit. I think it feels strange. I've spent so much time playing this game at this point. It feels strange starting again, one more time. I've I've restarted this game a lot of times now. I played this this beginning part out three times only recently I think I may have restarted twice before that so like five times I've played through the beginning of this game and I never finished it once but I feel like at this point I've become a, a master of this game at the hardest level maybe not maybe master is extreme because I mean I am getting killed here and there in stupid ways that I shouldn't get killed but I, I basically, um, uh, I've, I've at least mastered the game as much, uh, you know, uh, as much as I think to the extent where I can, I can beat it fairly easy, easily on the most difficult setting. And so that's, um, you know, um, yeah. Uh... That's something, and um, I feel like I should do that. I was sort of doing it in the other run, but um, it was tainted, so you got to start again, right? Does that make sense? It's a little crazy, but I think it makes sense. Uh, and I've already invested this much time. Why not? Why not? Why not do it correctly and just? just be able to say I beat the game on nightmare mode I think it I think it makes sense I just was rescued Phoebe and she ran back to uh, she ran back to uh, she ran back to yeah she was here right? and um, now Phoebe's run back to uh, to Marcos I guess or wherever she likes to go but she's she's no longer a captive which is great and all right there's level four wolves here Level four or level level three, some something, some some kind of powerful wolves that I shouldn't fight. And now I'm supposed to go collect the debt from this guy. And I'm gonna fail to collect the debt because I'm a nice person. And I don't really need the money that badly. Also, I'm not actually, you know, I'm not actually sure if it's even a very legitimate death debt. But I think as odd as that, I, I failed to collect the debt, and Marcos doesn't even get mad. I think that doesn't make sense. That's that's a flaw in the game. The game I, I was I was looking forward to talking to Marcos, and him saying, um, and him 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 being upset with me for not collecting the debt like I'm supposed to. And it never happens. I feel like that's that's um that's cheap. Like make make me pay for the consequence of the the decision that I made. I think like like standing up to Marcos should be something that, that would upset him a little bit. Standing up for him and saying that he's that he's uh that he's charging too much interest. Sammy, this will be at his Get your here. 
There he is. Tell me where Doris is when she's standing right in front of him. So I'm thinking about um, thinking about uh, turning the headphones off and just just playing without without uh, speaking. Hello, yeah, Doris. I think I'll do that. Um, bye, everybody. Tell Marcos to come down here himself if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. Double? That's robbery. That's what I told Marcos. You know him, he's extreme. If you pay him, this will all be over with. You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to, to, to a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. You're right about that. Forget the Brahmi. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this sword. Nothing special, but it's better than that rusty one you've got. With the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight or you're both dead. Got a job to do, Cassandra? You're running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the Drachmi. Good. Or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. 
Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. We have no other choice now. We need a plan. That's what I do best. This will take more than the usual tricks up your sleeve. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Cassandra! <sighs> Alexios! It's baby Cassandra! I just wanted to see Too bad they don't let us play off this part. It's gonna be fun, fun gameplay. Yeah. Well. Gameplay! Game designers, if you're listening, gameplay! Not cinemas, gameplay! Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh. yeah, I'm gonna turn the, uh, the mic back off again. Bye, everybody. How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! <laughs> Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mystheos with a hovel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you. How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits. You know me. Always prepared. What did I tell you? She will leave no stone unturned. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These bows will make me rich as Grisos. They're that good, are they? Wars brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? <laughs> you should be tired of this small town. That's what Marcos always says. You could make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you received this war. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. That's right, you are a Kefalonian. I'm putting the volume up a little bit. I don't know if you can hear me. I just put the volume up a little bit. It was a little low, I think. <coughs> um, 
Didn't didn't adjust it for you though, just for me. My headphones. Um, this is my favorite part of the game, I think. The beginning is is good. I, I like I like the way she is on Cephalonia. Once she leaves, things start to go wrong. And I like her relationship with um. Uh, now it feels too loud. I right, just lowered the volume back down. But the headphone volume on this game is kind of back and forth. Like one second it's too low and the next second it's too loud. Thank you. Right, there's a setting in this game that I think I want to use that just automatically uh, automatically fully stocks the bow. I probably should do that. Yeah, no, I'm not going to do that. Did I accidentally change the level scaling just now? I hope I did. Nightmare heavy level scaling. For some reason, I thought it said level scaling. For this option to be applied, the game needs to be reloaded. No. I don't know. It seems to think that okay. As long as it didn't, say it didn't reload anyway. I don't know why it thinks I'm trying to change level scaling, but whatever. As long as it doesn't do it, I guess I'm fine. Alright, so I gotta help Drusilla with a lumber issue. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need the thrashing. Uh, yeah. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marcus sure is lucky he's got you as a scapegoat. Uh, okay. Where, where are the bandits? Any idea where these bandits are? I'm not a tracker, I'm a voyeur. Turn off the They're headphones. They're in the mountains somewhere, that much I know. I'd sit close to the lumber camps. There's plenty of trees around. Why do you need this type of wood? I've been working on a new type of bow. It's more flexible, so it lasts longer and can fire at greater range. Only a very special kind of wood that grows high in the mountains can do. I like how it like starts out a little bit like Grand Theft Auto. I feel like it's just like random missions, and then eventually it starts to turn into like this big story where it's like find your mother, find your father. Um, uh, oh, it's evil cult. Oh, kill, kill everyone. Um, to protect to protect Sparta because you're the most glorious godlike hero on earth, and it's like ah, it started so strong. Like it could could have been fun if you were just like a regular person who's a mercenary working your way up, uh, doing odd jobs. I think that's that's actually more interesting because it's more real. Uh, I guess it wouldn't really be Assassin's Creed, but I mean this. I mean. This is pretty overblown. This 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 um, Assassin's Creed game, in, in spectacle, in in the superpowers and stuff like that, feels a little over the top. Uh, I'll deal with these bandits and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. <laughs> if you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. All right. I did something for you. Now you do something for me. Get my wood. Mm, okay. Um. Yeah. So I think maybe that's part of why every once in a while I feel like replaying in the beginning. It's like like, you know, Cephalonia, Phoebe's still alive. And she's not heading out to die in in, in Athens. And stuff like that. Uh, this is a good life. Like, Cephalonia is beautiful. I, I I don't really like. Feels odd. Wanting to leave this place. 
it's, it's actually one of the nicer areas in uh, not counting that one area where the disease is spreading and stuff like that I guess that when you get over there you can kind of see the appeal of escaping and that's like right over the hill so it's you know that's, that's sort of that's sort of always there I guess that's sort of the the other side of Cephalonia oh I, I accidentally discovered the thing uh, Greece, Cephalonia, taking the plunge, everyone on the island thinks this is the deepest dive. But there is a lake in the coastal Kolodai that is rumored to be bottomless. Oh right, right. Um, we have to solve that one. If you, if you are able to dive as far as the woman in marble, you will be able to claim me. Okay. Gotta remember to do that one. Alright, oh, this is where the spear is. This is kind of a fun little excursion. I don't think I can find the spear through the bird. You just have to power through. don't need a light, so shut up. Best stay out of sight. It's a good thing I don't mind the torch here. If I can want to meet you. <coughs> well, I got my bow. It can help with this. Any further away? No. Right. Gotcha. That one pretty well. Okay. Now the Sony cave is completed, and I got the spear, right? Did I? Or maybe I didn't. Oh, I guess maybe I did, because there's a check mark there. Wait a minute, uh, is there no way out here? I thought there would be a way out. Ah, uh, yeah, up there. Oh, no. I didn't think it would be a guy. That went great. Oh, I keep thinking I'm done. Well, it's been easy. Uh, better save. I don't know how long I've been playing. <laughs> 